If you want to get people to be successful, sometimes you have to shove it down their throats. I was uh, recently discussing with uh, a guy named Russell. Awesome guy, makes a shitload of money selling books and teaching people how to sell a shitload of books. Uh, and we had a discussion about our mutual frustration with people. Both of him and me, uh, we talked about our prices. And we both charge the same, about $2,000 a month. And we both charged a lot more in the past, and we also charged a lot less in the past. And our conclusion was the same. The reason we upped the prices was mostly because that's a way to guarantee that you'll get people that actually do what the fuck you tell them to do. Our biggest frustration, which we also mutually uh, agreed on, was the fact that people don't do what we tell them to do. <laughs> it's really, really hard to find a client that will actually listen to what you tell him to say. So, one of the biggest reasons uh, that most people are not more successful, you know, uh, if you really, you know, obviously when I, when I talk and, and coach about consistency and, and you know, massive action and, and leveraging and my different strategies, you know, these are all awesome stuff. Like these all definitely work and they're all amazing. But even though I treat them like, like, uh, like the Bible, you know, like the word of God, the gospel or something, it, it doesn't mean that they're the only way to do something. Like for every guy like me, well, there's not nobody like me, but uh, for every Robbie that talks about consistency and all that bullshit, you know, this and attention, there's somebody else who doesn't get any attention and he just trades stocks and he makes a shitload of money. And for every guy like that, there's another guy doing something else, maybe buying and selling real estate. So, you know, there's not one way to be successful. There's general principles, but there's many, many, many ways to go about it. Uh, so the biggest reason people are not successful in that aspect is simply because they're not coachable. Now, what's the, my definition of coachable? <laughs> you do what the fuck you say, you know, I say. You do what the fuck I tell you to do. Why would you fucking follow somebody and invest so much time and maybe money if you're not gonna listen to what they say? I mean, you want, it, you want entertainment, okay? You just wanna be entertained? Go watch, you know, and about money, watch the, the movie, the big, you know, the big short or The Wolf of Wall Street or, if, you know, maybe just go watch Game of Thrones. But, but, but if you're gonna invest time and listen to somebody, do what they say, you know, or else you're just spectating. What's the point? You, you don't get to pick and choose. You know, I like this, I don't like that. This is nice, this is not nice. Um, okay, I like this video. Um, no, in this video, I don't like what you said. Oh, no, no, so I'm not gonna do it. And it's always the things that will change your life. It's like, oh, he talks about, um, you know, uh, meditating five minutes a day, I'll do that. And then the next video is like, yeah, upload a video every day, get attention, massive action. Oh, no, 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 that's not for me. No, 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 no. I do I, any other. Oh, he uploaded another video. What do, what does the fan think about the channel? I think this. I think that. Oh yes, I'm an, I'm an active participant in the YouTube channel. <laughs> so yeah, that's. I mean, that's the way it goes. That that's literally the way it looks, to me. <laughs> because if if it wasn't, I have a lot more people that were like, oh my God, dude, you changed my life so much. And I do, I honestly do. I get people like that contacting me all the time, but, but not you know, proportionally to how many people follow me. If you look at somebody like Ty Lopez that gets you know, hundreds of thousands of views, well, he gets a couple of hundred people, maybe a thousand people, like, oh my God, you changed my life. But again, it's the same proportion. It's like, because no, nobody listens, not because it, it works or it doesn't work. Sorry for that. Uh, disrespectful but free video so I don't care um, be coachable be coachable and and I, I can't I'm not coachable by the way I'm only coachable with people I pay a shitload of money to that's the truth you know that's why I paid a lot of money to Dan Pena that's why I pay a lot of money to my first mentor that's why I pay a lot of money to anybody who I think can help me <laughs> because it's like okay I, I, I just know that if I don't pay him a lot of money I'm just not gonna do it, you know, I just, I just know that about me. 
if I'm not going to like take a big risk. So yeah, maybe, I mean, I know some people, five, four, two, one guy that can like not pay for something and still get the whole value, you know, and not, not from inspiration or desperation. Because I talk a lot about that. Not because he's like, oh my God, this is amazing. And not because he's desperate, like, oh my God, this is my final solution. If I don't do this, I'll die. No, but from an even keeled place, somebody who's coachable, just in general, balanced, and like, oh, okay, content, helpful. Let's execute. Okay, it's a bit uncomfortable. I need a bit of discipline. Okay, no problem. Yeah, that's the whole point. I mean, if it, if it wasn't uncomfortable, you know, <laughs> what are you trying to what are you, do you think it's like an intellectual study no the point is to you know to, to do some things that are new so 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 just make a fucking decision make your fucking mind up are you watching to get entertained are you watching to actually do what i tell you to do are you only doing what you've been told when you pay money um do you do that do you only do you only need like one session just to get you know the ball rolling Ask yourself the basic, simple question. What's it gonna, what is it going to take for me to actually take action on this? First of all, do I want to take action on this? And if the answer is yes, what is it going to take? And whatever the answer is, that's the answer. Uh, sorry. Like, maybe the answer is like, you need to work with that guy. That's the answer. Maybe the answer is, this is not for you. Maybe that's the answer. Uh, you're not going to apply it anyway. Maybe that's the answer. But whatever comes up, you have to listen to that intuition because when you ask your intuition questions like, hey, what do I need to take action on this? You're going to get an answer, but you have to actually listen and, and, and do it <laughs> or not do it depending on what it says. But believe me, if you've been watching somebody, if you've been following somebody, especially for a long time, it means you fucking like it. Okay, You like what the content is, but maybe you're just procrastinating. It's like that girl that you're afraid to approach so you just leer at her ass you just look at her for a long long time Turn left. maybe you're too scared to approach her and talk to her but it doesn't mean you wouldn't take it if you could so uh really think that deeply uh let me know if you have any questions about that this is kind of a personal topic so feel free to send me an email if you have a personal question uh but only if it's a really personal question uh don't use it as as an excuse uh, to not post a comment and let people know what you think. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you in the next video.